Hi, this is Josh McCormick. Uh, last time I did a Twitter tutorial video, it was to show you how to use advanced search, make a list, and populate that list. Uh, this time I wanted to talk to you about subscribing to lists. So let's say you know some people who uh, maintain lists and you think they are very clever and diligent and you would like to take advantage of their lists, but rather than replicating them, you would like to have them continue to support them, and you'd like to have easy access to this list from your own list of um, lists, list of lists. So to do this, you search for the person you want to, um, whose list you would like to subscribe to. And I am going to take a look at Greg Weiss's lists. I think he is a a uh, very clever guy. He often has uh, very valuable things to say. And I trust his judgment in who he connects to. So here are his lists. We're going to click on that. All right. Okay. And we are going to choose You Are So Awesome. Okay, so here are the, the tweets for that list. Uh, you can see who the members of it are and the subscribers by just clicking on those things. And you can subscribe to it right here. And then later on, obviously, if you want to unsubscribe, you just click there, no problem. So from now on, when you want to see this list, you can just look at your own list of lists. And in that list, there are two things you can look at, subscribe to and member of. Member of shows you what lists you are a part of. Subscribe to shows you all the lists that you have made. And you'll see uh, the picture of whoever made the list right there. So right here are all the lists that I made. And there are kind of a lot of them, so you have to just bear with me for a minute. And then here are the lists I've subscribed to. So there is You Are So Awesome, and it's right there, uh, and uh, you, can, you can access that easily now and let Greg continue to maintain that list for you. And uh, just quickly, in case um, I didn't mention it last time or you, didn't, um, you hadn't heard it before, the value of lists are that <clears throat> you can follow thousands of people but you don't want to necessarily look at all of their tweets uh, at any given moment. You might want to look, uh, you might want to just look at what your friends are saying or people in your area, that's the Dallas Fort Worth area, or um, things about particular interests or uh, areas of your profession. And this way you can just see t uh, tweets from people that uh, routinely tweet about those particular things. I hope this was helpful to you, and I'll talk to you again soon.